Sister Wives Mary Brown impresses fans with B&B special menu. And Mary Brown officially confirms split with Amos Andrews. Hey lovely viewers. Welcome to my shocking news channel. Sister Wives star Mary Brown has been busy promoting her bed and breakfast in Utah over the past few weeks. The 53-year-old has already put up multiple events over the past few months. She also has her friend, Jen Sullivan, on her side to run the business. Recently, some Redditors discussed one of Jen's recent efforts to encourage people to stay at their inn. Many were also surprised to see that they're serving foods that are difficult to find today. In an Instagram post, Mary shared that Lizzie's Heritage Inn will hold a street. Patrick's Day Tour According to the Sister Wives star, participants will get to see the B&B &B Inn, St. Patty's Style, for $50, while kids under 3 are free. She even hinted that guests may find a pot of gold at the end of the event. Mary also added that she'll be sharing stories while leading her guests through the inn. Some Redditors reacted to a comment from Mary's friend, Jen Sullivan, in an FB group about gluten-free foods in Utah. According to Jen, she's encouraging people to take a visit to Lizzie's Heritage Inn, as it offers a fully celiac-safe breakfast for their guests. Several Redditors were impressed that the Sister Wives Stars B&B offers such foods. Others also pointed out that Mary Brown's B&B has much better food and service compared to Christine's Inn. Here are some of the comments she received. It's so hard to find celiac-safe gluten-free places, kind of nice to see. Lizzie Inn is 10,000 times better than Christine pretending she discovered a cure for menopause via pink-colored water and McKelty shaming women for having PPD. Oh that's actually really nice for such a small BNB. Very cool. When I ordered a Christmas ornament from there over the holidays, I asked a question and it was Jen who responded smiley face, I thought it was pretty neat. OMG I need me some gluten free waffles. Sister wives, fans think Mary Brown's B&B &B needs more life. Despite the positive feedback about Mary Brown's B&B &B services, some Redditors from a different thread discovered that the outside view of the Sister Wives stars in looks dead. According to some, the inn could use some landscaping. Others also suggest adding more trees and plants around the property, as it looks too dry. And empty. She really needs some landscaping, it looks so bare. She definitely needs to plant some trees to replace the ones she had to take out. And some shrubbery would be nice too. She desperately needs landscaping. Oh wow. What a dreadful looking place. Clean the clutter off porch, landscape, get rid of those cheap solar pathway lights. I could only imagine how dingy the inside looks. Sister Wives star Mary Brown finally breaks silence about her status with her new boyfriend, Amos Andrews. The 53-year-old has been silent about the Utah man since announcing their relationship on January 17th. She suddenly went back to her frequent posting of cryptic messages on IG as well, resulting in speculation that the two are facing struggles. Until recently, Mary finally shared where she and Amos stand today. In an Instagram post, Mary revealed her new boyfriend, Amos. According to the Sister Wives star, they've been dating since October last year, but she wanted to keep their relationship private for a while and focus more on getting to know each other. The former first wife of Cody also gushed over how Amos likes Christmas as much as she does and that her dog, Zona, likes him. However, Amos later made headlines after people began to dig into his past and discovered that he went through three failed marriages. Mary recently took to Instagram to share her weekly livestream with her friend, Jen. The Sister Wives star was showered, with comments asking about Amos amid her weeks of silence about him. Later in the video, Mary Brown revealed that she and Amos had already called it quits last week. She also revealed that the online hate he received due to his past played a significant role in why they decided to part ways. Some were saddened by the couple, while some Redditors cheered for Mary and hoped that she'd find a better man. That's okay. He was a rebound. Next. Yeah, she needs to date more people. Than just Cody and the next guy. Yeah, it's a bummer. But, welcome to regular people dating. It's a roller coaster, but it's your roller coaster. And when you find the right person, it's magic. And sometimes, even finding not the right person is fun. 
Poor Mary but better to cut the cord before it got too serious. He's shady as s asterisk t. Don't wait for the whole country to figure your boyfriend out. Hire a private investigator, Mary, or maybe Google the guy. I hope she's okay. I just want her to have fun and be free. This guy seemed to have a bit more baggage than expected. Sister Wives Mary Brown focuses on business. Mary has also been focusing on her businesses over the past few weeks before announcing her split with Amos. The Sister Wives star recently unveiled her new business, Worthy Up, which is a subscription-based website for people seeking connection, inspiration, and growth. She also offers private videos and Q&A sessions for a small price. Mary Brown has also been promoting her Utah B&B with her friend, Jen. The two also made headlines recently after fans discovered that they offer a fully celiac safe breakfast for their guests. What do you think about this video? Please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this video.